Every school resource officer in South Carolina will soon be equipped with new gear. These tactical vests will add an extra layer of protection for those who serve on the front lines with our children. News 19's Jenna Krasina has more. The school resource officers, they have a duty to protect the kids. We have a duty to protect them. Within seconds, school resource officers across the state will be able to throw on an extra layer of protection thanks to a donation. This active shooter vest by U.S. Patrol Tactical will allow SROs to be ready if an intruder comes inside of a school. This is the regular vest that they wear. It's not going to stop everything. It's not going to stop a rifle bullet. This, this vest will. So this that extra protection that they need. You know, we've seen in some of the shootings across the United States that they're not using pistols. They're coming in with rifles, high power rifles. That vest won't stop it. This vest will. SROs already have a vest, but this one has a thick piece of steel that can be hit not just once, but multiple times. Our regular vests don't stop everything, so just knowing that, you know, get that extra protection, it's, it's really cool. U.S. Patriot, founded in South Carolina, makes military and law enforcement products. But when owner Paul Yu was picking up his children from school, he saw the need for this extra protection. I saw the SRO walk outside and I realized, you know, I had a light bulb moment and realized the officers protecting my kids at r &E are not protected themselves. The company donated a few vests within Richland County then decided to do more and donate one vest to every school district in the state. We ask our SROs to run, you know, in the Army they said, we run to the sound of gunfire. And we don't run away from it. And that's what we're asking our SROs to do every single day in the state and across the country. And um, when they're doing it on behalf of our children, um, I want them to feel as protected and safe as possible. Sheriff Lott says these vests are ready to go and could be in schools within a week but they will definitely be ready for the start of the new school year. In Richland County, Jenna Corzina, News 19, WLTX. Governor McMaster says there are still some school districts that don't have the funds to have school resource officers, but the goal remains to have at least one in every school across the state.